Back in New York with Houston, number 26 on the clock now. Who do we like best, Mel? You thought Glenn maybe to Pittsburgh. I don't think they thought DeCastro would be there, so Glenn's still available now. Merciless, the pass rusher, he'll come off the board pretty soon. You think about Harrison Smith, the best safety behind Mark Barron and Kobe Fleener. Andrew Luck's go-to option with the Cardinals. The Houston Texans at long last made the playoffs last year, winning the South, winning their opening playoff game at 10 and 6. Now where do they go? With the 26th pick in the 2012 NFL Draft, the Houston Texans select Whitney Merciless, linebacker, Illinois. Well, they lost Mario Williams, Williams and D'Amico Ryans, not to mention the tackle Winston. So uneasy is the head that wears the crown. But you talk about an improvement in defense, Wade Phillips taking over last year, and how much the Texans improved second overall in total D. And now, if there's ever a name for a defensive player, it would be Whitney Merciless. That's what Houston hope he's going to be, Coach. We had no mercy on the Big Ten. He led the nation in tackles, led the nation in forced fumbles, and led the Big Ten in tackles for loss. One year of production. Here he is rushing inside in the nickel, which I really like about him, Mel. He's not a one-dimensional outside rusher. He can go inside and mismatch you against certain guards, much, much like Alden Smith did last year at Missouri before the 49ers took him. He needs to improve in the briar patch, runs right at him. He's got to become a more all-around run defender. I think he can do that. A relentless motor, spent a lot of time with Ron Zook, the former coach of the Illini in the offseason. And this kid has a huge upside. I like the pick at this point in the draft. Natural pass rush moves, natural pass rush instincts. Question is, why did it take till this year? He had two sacks going in. This year, 16 sacks, nine forced fumbles. One year wonder, but this one year was special for Whitney Merciless. And remember, in Houston, they did all that with their third string quarterback after they got Matt Schaub coming back next year. They're, they should be excited, these Texans. Cincinnati next.